Hi, welcome to our channel Roshwa, All is Well. My name is Ujwal and today I would like to present you to the Prime Cuber. The Prime Cuber is not my own robot, but it is a robot created by David Gilday. I found this robot at the site mindcuber.com and I would like to give credit to David Gilday for making such a wonderful robot. Let's go to the site and let's see what's there. As you can see here, this is the website mindcuber.com and you can build the many types of cube solvers depending on the set you have. So I have the Lego Education Spike Prime set. So I built this one and if you click spike here, it shows you a video. These are the instructions and let this load and these are the parts you need and if you scroll, scroll through the building instructions you can hopefully build the robot and we they also have the software for you to download which is this and just follow the instructions to get your prime cuber to solve a cube as you can see, this is the Prime Cuber fully built. And here are the components. This big motor moves this box where we put the cube in like this. And the small motor moves this arm which grabs hold of the cube. And the big motor will move to make up a move of the cube. This color sensor will sense the colors of the cube and it will follow tables to solve it. And the distance sensor always makes sure that the cube is in its place. And if it's not, it's going to just stop the program. So after you turn on the hub, and go to, go to zero. I downloaded the main program in zero, so I have to run it from there and start the program. You always have to wait until this arrow is indicated on the hub. When it, when it is shown, put the cube after scrambling it. Sc scrambling it. Couple of things to note. If like when you install the cube slot it might be tilted but no worries because after you start the program and you're and it says you're there it's ready to insert the cube you can simply press the arrow buttons to change the position and make it straight right now i just click the arrows to make it straight and then you can insert the cube in one more thing there's an additional step that makes like the cube, the robot solve the cube faster. And if you want, you can install it and it's going to be very fast. So let's scramble the cube. Okay. So right now I just scrambled the cube and let's put it in the slot and let's see what happens. It's in action. The arm is working. The color sensor is sensing all the colors and it's going to match it with its tables. This is working, this is working very smoothly. It's matching its tables. There we go, it starts to solve it.
As you can see, the robot solved the cube. And wait until the hub shows this arrow. It means to take the cube out. And it will display an arrow again to put the cube back in if you want to do it a second time. In conclusion, this robot really thrilled me. I didn't know that people could build so many intelligent robots and I've seen one today. And I would like to thank David Gilday again for making such an intelligent and amazing robot. I hope you have the chance to build one too. And also please like and subscribe to our channel. See you in the next video. Bye.